don't just stand there. Adventure awaits. Adventure and a princess. A knight never keeps a princess waiting, huh? Ah, nothing quite so valorous as rescuing royalty. You trouble yourself over much with the mundane, my friend. This is a quest for love. Now, quickly, to the Cyclops lair. And always remember to take the scenic route. Life's too short, Squire! <laughs> this one-eyed fiend holds my beauty captive. Who knows how many brave souls have died by its hand trying to rescue her as we do now. Squire, look! The monsters mash our minions! We must defeat them! Please before the light. This guy think the clock tower with one eye is a cyclops, and we're just going along with it? I mean, he needs help, like professionally. You're rolling dice with the teenager to swing imaginary swords, Boo Boo. Okay, I see your point. <laughs> My name is Rivote. The Cyclops joined me with some foul eye. I can scarce go on, but ah, I hear the princess cry. A press on without me. Find the princess. The cry of a princess. I'd recognize it anywhere. Hold fast, princess. Your rescue approaches. Bye, everybody. 
break away. When if she's by my side, come in. And guards me, the golems have gone astray. And when our hope has fled, runs... What shall I slay evil with today? Princess, where are you? Give a shout. I can't hear you over this. Oh, damn it. I see. This doll must be his princess. A keepsake of her lost love, no doubt. To know my love is near. Have you brought me my sweet, sweet daffodil? Ah, oh, yes, the princess. I have her here. Why, squire, you must be quite blind to think this common made a princess. Uh, meaning no offense, madame. The princess has the tall and straight back bearing of royalty, the slim silhouette of noble refinement and has long blonde hair, straight as a quiver of golden arrows. Quickly, quickly, go get the real princess! Saving an imaginary princess is better than saving none at all. Princess, with me. <clears throat> Squire, where are you? I feel my heartstrings tag. Have you the princess at last? Safe and sound. Was there ever a doubt? Ah, now that we are reunited, our quest nears its end. But what's this? It seems the Cyclops is up, and it's none to please with us. He summons his horticultural horde. Come, Squire, to arms! <laughs> ah, my darling princess, in the scant few hours we departed, I have written you a dozen poems. I beg you, allow me to spill forth a lyric of or five that I might express my overflowing affection before it drowns me. This one I wrote when I tripped on a rock in front of you. And now, when first I beheld you, vision so sweet, I fumbled and tumbled and bubbled myself. Slipped and tripped right off my head. I didn't say in the world. You swept. Do you like it? You hate it, don't you? Your silence speaks clearer than my poor before I express. Very upset. These words come to me in a dream. A very short dream, my dear, but, but that's a dream it was. <clears throat> Whether it's one or two, my love, she lights up any room. And my floor's never dusty. She is trusted. Right. And her faith See? Love sweeps away the dust. Like a, like a brush, or feather duster, or, or, or some third thing that sweeps, yeah? It's a metaphor. <laughs> Did you think for a second I would leave you in the clutches of the wretched one I missed? Okay. Every moment I learned of your circumstance, I took action <laughs> straight away and made comfortable. <laughs> then, while my squire retrieved you, I single-handedly kept the Cyclops at bay. It is true. But, you better shut up. 
I've seen this happen before. He's in a love trance. We're gonna have to get physical to snap him out of it. <laughs> uh, no way, girl. I only narrate up to fifth base. After that, you on your own. No, I'm saying we have to hit him. Get your mind out of the... Wait, what's fifth base? You don't know fifth base? Fifth base is tea and crumpets, but without a chaperone. <laughs> Just talking about it feels scandalous. Wait, I thought fifth base was exchanging file directories with totally lossless compression. Where are you guys getting all these bases? It can't be. And yet, my sweet, tell me true. Has your beauty yet increased since last we held one another? You've done, you've done something. Don't tell me. Um, a new varnish, no? No, no, you, uh, you trim your bristles, have you not? Uh, whatever it is, it is. I must say, quite uh, story, huh? Looking at you now, I find myself transfixed by your rapturous gaze. Ah, let us bask here in the pool of love shared silence for what trite poetry could hope to capture the quiet beating of two hearts as one. Shh, shh hush, my love. Do not answer. Just. Let this moment last forever. Mm. Don't just stand there. Adventure awaits. Adventure and a princess. And night never keeps a princess waiting, huh? is complete and yet I confess ours is just beginning we must away to that grand adventure called love remember all I've taught you and you shall go far this world is full of adventures you need only keep your eyes and your heart ever open to its wonder now bid me adieu fair squire for I must away with a swiftness Night never keeps a princess wedding, after all. Your strange manner has moved me. I shall always remember you. Farewell, Ron. No, Sir Rivote. A finer night I have never known. Sincerely hope that was a magic broom. <laughs>